sea foam spray. This is the stuff you put in the intake. So those ports, one, two, three, four, they're gunked up. So what I did is just spray. So again, sea foam intake spray, and I'm using it to clean out these ports. But look, yeah, that's 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 hard shit, bro. It's not gonna work, and you don't want this wood to break off inside the intake runners. You have one runner here, one runner here, one runner here, one runner there. And the four cylinders. You have one intake runner for each cylinder. So either way. I'm gonna spray one more time. And I'm gonna shut the hood because I gotta go to work and relieve Jose. And we out. No, no, I'm good. So, one last time, I sprayed the shit. Actually, let's do it again while we're on camera. Oh, yeah. In there, in there, in there, in there. Oh, yeah. Look at that. And then I'm just gonna spray all the gunk that's here tomorrow and here all right that's gonna decrease all that shit and this make this fucking valve cover sing tomorrow sing baby and for anyone that's curious an anal bitch doing it with one hand yup I don't know if you can see this but after I took the fuel rail off with the injector still attached I like to put all the bolts back where they belong. All the bolts back, one, two, three, four, five, and the three that hold the fuel rail on. So I, I don't have to go digging. Everything's where it needs to be. And that's how we do it. VTech baby. But when you take this WD-40, you spray it in this, in this guy right here. Right scraped up all this carbon it's just a milk